advance is... Congratulations. Thank you, Steve. Now, you are also in the military. You're in the uh, United States Army Reserves. What's it like for you to take off the, fa take off the fatigues, put on these gowns and outfits, and start campaigning as Miss Universe? Hopefully as Miss Universe, if I have the privilege enough to be crowned. But as Miss USA, I have had the opportunity to really just go around and show the world the diversity that we have as women. Uh, myself and the other 85, thank you. Myself and the other 85 contestants are all so diverse. We, we represent so much coming from our countries and I'm just so incredibly excited, honored, and I'm, I feel humbled to know that I represent strong, powerful women, especially women that serve our country. Thank you. Thank you, USA. Kicking off tonight's very first round of competition. The judges are ready. The fans are ready. It's the first three of your 13 finalists. I'm moving up LA. I drive a sports car just to prove. USA. The last Miss Universe winner to wear a yellow competition suit was Layla Lopez. Heading into the final nine is USA. I'm a captain in the United States Army Reserve and I grew up in a military family. My mom and dad both served proudly, and they inspired me to do the same. When I was competing for Miss USA, my mom had just been placed on hospice. She was battling lung cancer. But when I won, she was so incredibly proud of me. District of Columbia! Three months later, my mom passed away. And all the way up to her last moments, she was extremely strong. And I know that she will be with me when I compete, standing right next to me. USA.